earlier today, and here's what he had to say. Whitney, I am currently at East Bigelow Gulch Road, and like you mentioned, it's been shut down all evening since around 6 o'clock tonight. I got here around 6.30, and it's been closed ever since. And it's probably going to be closed into the morning. So here's what we know what happened. Just after 6 p.m. tonight, Spokane County Sheriff's deputies were called to a home here on Bigelow. The call was a dispute between two neighbors here. Now that call turned out to be a shooting. Two men were hurt in that incident. According to the Sheriff's Office, one of those men was killed. The other was wounded. He was taken to the hospital with life-threatening injuries. I'm told he is still in critical condition at this hour. Like I said, those two men were neighbors. We do not yet know the cause of death or the cause of the injuries. Now, the scene here is frankly massive. At one point, there were well over a dozen police cars here. Major Crimes is leading the investigation. Last I'm told, they're currently waiting on a search warrant. East Bigelow Gulch Road here is blocked off for nearly a mile. Right now, Bigelow Gulch between Jensen and Wiley is closed. So for your morning commute, please plan on that being closed. And if we happen to get it open earlier, we will let you know. So that's likely to cause some serious traffic problems tomorrow. In fact, when I first arrived at the scene here tonight, car after car was being forced to turn around. I even have, I saw three different semi-trucks have to navigate their way out of here. So again, East Bigelow Gulch Road, avoid it tonight and into tomorrow morning most likely. A shooting here resulted in one man in the hospital and another killed. Mark Whitney.